people just flocked the store and that the line went around the block. My name is Laura Church and my grandfather started Church's Chicken in 1952. The first location was downtown San Antonio, right across from the Alamo. It was a walk-up window. There wasn't even any seating outside of the store. So the smell just would permeate through the area downtown, and that drew people there. The original menu was chicken. For the first three years, it was just chicken. He also was a very forward thinker, because back then there weren't fast food places. I think he was a, a trailblazer in that way. The test kitchen was in my grandfather's home. All the kids would all come over and everyone went to my grandparents' house on Sunday. So yes, there was some testing of different batters and different chicken recipes, and that was always talked about. Quality product at a good value. It's our family legacy. I tell people I have the best job in the world. I play with food all day. That's really what I do for a living. My name is Kevin Houston, and I am the Senior Director of Research and Development at Church's Chicken. Church's is humbly proud of, of being part of Texas, and, and it shows in our menu. You know, it's why you see the, the jalapeno. It's why you see big, bold flavors. Our products are handmade by scratch in small batches all, all day long. They're, they're not mild or, or boring in any matter. They're loaded with flavor, very decadent as well. That's something that you can only get at Church's Chicken. Don't forget about the honey butter now. Just imagine that hot butter melting into that biscuit, all that gooey and chewy. When you break it, you can see the flakiness of the biscuit. So all that together, that will make Church's Chicken biscuit the best. <laughs> My name is Jackie Ross. I do research and development for Church's Chicken. I've been with Church's for 27 years and enjoyed every minute of it. What set churches apart is the people. We've got a lot of loyal customers, and they raise their children eating churches. We are known to feed family, especially like holidays, Sunday dinner, or family reunion. We've been a part of the communities that we serve for a long time, and we're in lots of places of the country where our competitors have left or, or never were, frankly. And we've revitalized these buildings. They're brand new, beautiful, and shiny. We're still serving delicious food, and we've always been there for them and don't plan on ever leaving. The future of churches is bright. What we're going to still be doing in the next 70 years is still making product by hand, by scratch, we are pioneers of timeless flavor, and we've only just begun. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to the great state of flavor. 